morning, everyone. Welcome to a little week in my life. I'm about to go to the doctor. You want some food? Because I'm like 100% sure that I have strep that I caught from over the weekend. I don't know. I was looking like my, I woke up, my throat was just like not feeling good. Can we not walk on the counter? And so I, you know, took a little flashlight and it looks scary in there. I have registered online and gonna go in. Get tested, which like I don't feel bad. I took my temperature. I don't have a fever. Like I don't like feel sick. Like I've got energy to go. So I don't really know what's going on. Like and it only is sore if like I swallow anything. So I don't really know what's happening. But yeah, we're about to go to the doctor. Happy Monday. It's about 8:40 ish. So hopefully, like we just get some antibiotics going, and we'll be good to go. That's really the only reason why I'm going. Because I feel like anything that's like in the store won't do it justice because it looks really scary in there. We'll just see how all this plays out. Okay, just got back from the doctor's office and the strep test was negative, which I'm confused by, but whatever. I guess it's kind of common for strep tests to come back negative, even if you still have it. I don't really know, but point is, um, they're treating it like it is strep, so they gave me uh, amoxicillin, and so I'll be taking that twice a day for the next 10 days. Like, I don't have a fever, like, literally nothing else. Like, I feel great. I could go on a run if I wanted to. Not that I would ever willingly go on a run, but, like, I have the energy for it. Like, I, I would like to go out and do things. They didn't tell me if I was, like, contagious. I'm sure I'll be fine uh, within 24 hours of taking this medicine, but, like, but it is almost 12 o'clock. Hey, girl. You want to say hi to the vlog? Say hi to everyone. Betty rubs. I'm have, I need to edit uh, today's video. Oh my gosh, for everywhere. But that's what I'm about to do for the next, whoa, don't step on the keyboard, for the next few hours. She's in a little bowl. <laughs> Changed, I took like a 10 minute nap because I kept like falling asleep. Which I don't really know why because I woke up like wested, west, wested. I woke up really wested this morning. <laughs> Rested. <laughs> Hello! It is so vibey in here. We've got the fireplace going. That's been going on for a while. It's not like emitting heat or anything. It's just here for the ambiance. No, I literally, I have been sitting here in this corner. I finished editing my video. I got a lot of other work stuff done. And then I've just kind of been chilling. I had some buttered noodles. Girl dinner. But yeah, no, literally, I took one of these capsules that they prescribed me this morning. And it already is feeling so much better. Praise the Lord! And so I'm assuming after like 24 hours, I'll be good to go like contagious wise because that's how like antibiotics work, right? Or is that like even, I don't know. But I'm assuming I'll be fine tomorrow. That being said, I have a very exciting appointment. <laughs> Obviously y'all will know what it is, but um, it is about nine o'clock. Um, I FaceTime some of my friends, we're doing little updates, but I'm probably about to get in bed so I can like wind down and go to sleep early so I can get ready for my appointment tomorrow. I kind of forgot about it. Well, this morning I originally was like, hey, I might have to reschedule because of this whole sickness ordeal. And then I was like, you know what? No, I'll be fine. So that being said, we're going to go to sleep and I will see you chickens in the morning. Good morning. I don't like this lighting. Happy Tuesday. It is about 11 and I'm about to leave because we have a fun appointment like I was saying last night. This is my outfit of the day. It's so funny, I just did an outfit of the day to send in my friend's group chat. <laughs> I feel like I'm just like repeating myself, but in reality, I'm not because you don't know what I'm wearing yet. 
Marley wants to, oh my goodness gracious, sorry. I usually put my camera on her bed, but this man wanted to sit there instead. Did not mean to take your spot, I apologize. So, I'm wearing this little onesie, it's from Maritzia. Um, that's just like what the top looks like, and then I put a little hoodie over it. It's a little overcast today, so I was feeling like hoodie vibes. It's not cold by any means, but I'm like, this will do. I'm wearing these little gold hoop earrings. These are from Studs. The little small ones i don't know where these are from um oh wait they might both be from studs i don't know um we're in my louis vuitton lock and then amazon ring altered state fendi apple watch these are from the pants store and then two of these bracelets are from mkt i have my permanent bracelet both of these are from sam moon and then i have my purse from macy's so a little black and white action but we are on our way to go get more lip filler and I'm so excited. I'm just really hoping that it doesn't bruise <laughs> that bad because I have some events going on, not events. I have something later going on this week, which y'all will see later. And I'm like, I, I can't go up to this place with bruised lips. Do you know what I'm saying? You don't, cause you don't know what the event is. It's a date. I was like, it's a date. A date with someone new. But yeah, we're going up to Beauty Bars. This is the med spa that I've been going to for several months now. I get like my IV therapy done there. I've gotten, that's where I got my jaw filler done. Freaking love them, but we're gonna go up there. It's about a 30 minute drive, it's up in Allen, and get our lips done. This works fast. Yeah, it's yeah, <laughs> really strong. Great. No, she's it's, yeah, it's, it. <laughs> it's, it's, it's instead of doing the filler syringe because the filler syringe is so much thicker. That's what bruises you. Oh, so Terrence is so doing a little bit, and so a you, thinner one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Show you yeah. Difference. Look how much. Oh, whoa. Yeah. And, and a lot of a lot of injectors don't do that. It's yeah. like an advanced but technique. They don't. Well, I've been teaching for some time. Yeah. That's like significantly. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. I feel so like I'm drooling. <laughs> Ivy is um, swollen or bruised. So. Okay, cool. Yeah, so you'll like that a lot better. Alright, we are done. They look so good. Y'all, Tara slays at literally everything. I don't know why I'm surprised. Like, I knew she was gonna kill it, and she did. And I don't know if y'all picked up on it. I don't know if the vlog camera got it completely, but the needle that she uses, or the syringe, or whatever you want to call it, it's not nearly as thick as what, like, I guess people like a lot of um med spas use it's like a thinner one so the bruising isn't nearly as bad like it's significantly thinner than like the normal filler syringe i don't know the technical terms for it but it was super easy super quick she did one full syringe um we did a lot in the top because it was like that that's where it was needed okay and then some in the bottom but they look so good i'm obsessed okay so it's about one o'clock i've kind of just been on my phone like updating my stories now i think i'm gonna go to home goods i my mouth is still somewhat <laughs> numb so it feels a little funny but i'm going to home goods because have y'all seen all the cute fall decor that they have out right now i want to go look at it because i want to make a tiktok about it i want to make two tiktok two two, blah, blah, two tiktoks about it but yeah we're gonna go see what all they have real almost just got ran over in this parking lot this lady was going so fast and i was like in the middle of the road i was like hello anyway um that could not have been a bigger fail i think just because like of tiktok everything is just sold out like i didn't even really see much in there but i did end up getting that pink pumpkin candle that i showed y'all briefly i still have a lot of my fall decor from last year that i'm gonna use but i just the scent they have you know what i mean but look how cute this candle is it's not my favorite scent like it's not bad but I really just liked it because of the shape. 
But now I'm gonna go up to Ulta because it's literally right above me because there's this, um, you know the brand Ink Box or like Ink something where you can do like temporary tattoos. I kind of want another tattoo. And so I just kind of want to see what it looks like. And so we're just gonna try Ink Box and see how I like it for like two weeks to see if I really want another one. I did try going last week, but they were sold out of everything. So I hope this one has some in stock. They had so many options. The other one that I went to, there was one option and it was not what I was wanting. But I'm wanting to get something like this, like these butterflies right here. This is just gonna be fun. And there's also a lot of other cute ones that I can just like put around just for temporary, for the time being. It is now two o'clock. Um, I saw some other like work stuff to do whenever I get home. That's about it for now. Yeah, I think I'm probably just gonna head home. Hello, I am back home. And here are the little tattoos I'm gonna put on. Look how cute. They're just little butterflies. And there's a meaning behind this. I'm not going to explain it because it's just something between me and God only. But it's not just like, oh, I want a butterfly. No, like there's significance, unlike these. But I was thinking, you know, like one like this, kind of towards the wrist. And I don't know how this is gonna go. I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. I accidentally just tried to put this butterfly on and I forgot to take off the plastic and now it's on the plastic and not on my dang skin. There's no other butterfly. Um, I will say the placement of this couldn't be worse. I hate it. Um, I mean, you know what? It's fine. It's fine. It'll probably stay on for like three days. This is okay. So this isn't the ink box ones because don't those like actually last for like two weeks? Like you don't put them on like a temporary like with water. In other news, this is one of the most exciting packages. It is my birthday outfit. I wasn't gonna show y'all until like my actual birthday. Y'all get the luxury of knowing. Only the YouTube people, the YouTube fam, get to see the. Reveal before my actual birthday, but this isn't going on Instagram. It's not going on TikTok, not going on anything else until my birthday. So We're gonna try it on. So it's from Outcast, the boutique Outcast. Oh, this is good quality I was kind of nervous about the quality because I've never ordered from them before But I saw this girl at this event that I was at a few months ago And I was like that is the prettiest dress I've ever seen unbeknownst to me. It wasn't a dress It was a two-piece set thing and so Let's go try it on it kind of gives me, um, what's it called, Shark Tale vibes, you know that movie, <laughs> with the fish. Um, but this is from Outcat, I already explained that. This top, or this skirt looking thing, looks like it's connected to the skirt, it's actually connected to the top. But yeah, very different vibe in comparison to last year, but I think it's so cute. I have no idea what my plans are. La, 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 la. I'm gonna need to like fashion tape this though, because so a little, it falls down a little bit, like it has a little sticky stuff right here, but that only does so much as I'm sure a lot of you girlies know. Hello, it is a little bit later, it's about six o'clock and I am getting ready to go to church. Watermark, I don't go there on Sundays, but I only go there on Tuesdays because they have like a young adults church service that they do every week, Watermark does called The Porch. They're not like affiliated with Watermark, they just like do The Porch at Watermark. Anyways, it's very casual. Like people wear anything and everything there. That's why I'm wearing this t-shirt. Um, I'm about to leave to drive up there. It starts at seven. Got my Bible, we're ready to go. Uh, I posted a TikTok about this and y'all, it went like kind of crazy on TikTok. And it's so cute, it's a Jesus Bible. I got it from Amazon, as well as the Bible tabs are linked on my Amazon storefront. But it's so cute. Time to go.
I changed Marley's food because it, the brand that I, I learned that the brand that I was using wasn't like the best for cats. You know, changing food can come with its consequences or its side effects or whatever you want to call them. Long story short, um, Marley has gotten poop all over my bed, like little streaks of it. And there's just like diarrhea all up in her um, fur. So we're gonna have to wash this lovely lady in the sink. This is never fun for either of us. I mean, it is all over her. I know, sweetie, but we have, I know. Hey, hey, it's okay. We're gonna try and do this quick and then we're both gonna be happy campers because you're no longer gonna have Do you not smell yourself? I mean, it's rank. Too bad. Maybe it was. Oh. Well, that was a joyful time. Don't you feel so much better? You don't have any more poopy butt. I know. I know. I'm sorry, girl. I am gonna schedule you a lion cut though because your fur is kind of getting out of hand. All right. I really don't have a lot of like work stuff to do today, so I thought about going to Home Goods again, again, but it's a different location to see if they have a little bar cabinet thing because i've been wanting to put one here i just haven't found one that i like so i might go to see what they have there i don't know just to kill time i may be sitting later tonight that's really the all that i have planned but like i have tomorrow's video done so i'm just kind of like and then another video that i'm filming i can't film until tomorrow so I'm really just vibe it today but my lips look good they're not nearly as bruised as they were last time y'all last time i got my lips done they looked purple for like three days but you can't even tell there's just like a slight bruise right here. We love that. And Marley is still babying herself. So I'm gonna go ahead and head that way. I think, so the one, the home goods that I usually go to is up off like Park Lane, but I'm gonna go to the one in White Rock and see what they got. Sorry, that was the cutest little home goods. Also, I've never been to one that was like combined with Marshalls before. I've only been to one that was like with TJ, TJ Maxx. But anyways, it had so many other like different things than from the normal one that I went to. And y'all remember those ghost pillows that went viral last year that came in like a pack of two? They were kind of plush, fluffy ones. Yeah, well I found them, but in pink. They were the last pink ones. There were other white ones. There was also a skull. I think I've videoed that briefly. Like, I'm so excited to put these on my couch because I feel like a white pillow would just not look good on my cream colored couch. You know what I mean? So I'm like, pink, say freaking less. And they also had that like bedazzled pink ghost pillow. I thought that was really cute, but I don't think it would have gone with like my vibe. I'm so excited. They were $25 for two. And then I also got another fall candle. That it's more fall scented than the one that I got yesterday because the one that I got yesterday really I only got because it was in the shape of a pumpkin. Okay, but no, obviously I did not find a like bar cabinet thing in there. There were cute ones. There's a really cool looking black one, but I don't want black. I don't really know what I'm going for, to be honest. I kind of just am expecting to see it and be like, yep, that's the one. Ooh, maybe I should try Ross. They sometimes have some good things in there. You're like, what? I'm not just strolling there. Linda comes all cozy. Hi girl, I miss you. You taking a little cat nap? 
I actually went to several other shops after. It's now four o'clock. So I was like, wait, I think it'd be cute to find like a cutie little dress for my date tomorrow. But did I find anything? No. Did I try on like 10 different things? Yes. I don't know why I always feel the need to buy new things when it comes to like little dates or whatever, but here we go. Anywho, these are the pillows. Look how cute. We've got a boy and a girl because of the eyelashes. It's so cute. Put the girl one there, the boy one there. Look how cute! <laughs> and then I also got this candle in the scent, cinnamon vanilla. It's very fall esque. It did have like a puppy dog lid on it, but I switched it with this one. It smells so good. I'm just going to sit here for a little bit because I am babysitting tonight. My cousin, I, I help her out with babysitting every now and then, but yeah, I'll be going over there around like 6.45, I believe. So I'm just gonna chill. I might start planning part of my birthday because I, I need to get like a reservation and like a number of people. Hello everyone, good morning. It is Thursday. I didn't vlog the rest of the night just because I literally didn't do anything and then I was babysitting. But it is about 10 a.m. I need to get gas. And then I'm going up to Grapevine to go to the painted tree because I I still just want to find like a cute outfit for tonight. My goal, like what I'm envisioning is just like a cute casual dress with like sneakers. So I don't know. We'll see what we find. Um, painted tree, it, it's like a cute little, they have like different booths everywhere, like different boutiques that go in different sections of the store. It's where my mom used to have um, her little boutique section at, but um, I'm not going to the one up in Flyer Mountain. I'm going to the, I think there's one in Grapevine just because it's closer. So I'm going to go up there. I have a lot of filming stuff to do today. That is the plan. I'm going all the way up. Ah, I'm going all the way up. Ah, I'm letting go in my heart. Ah, of everything that holds me down. Oh, no. and it's like the love. Hello. Okay, sorry. It is much later. It is 5:15. I'm in the middle of I say I'm in the middle. It doesn't look like I'm in the middle of, but I am in the middle of getting ready for my date tonight. I showered. I tried to do my one hour express self tan, but I don't think I had enough time to let it actually sit. So I feel like that was just like a complete waste of time. And then I made my get ready drink. I have my recipe on TikTok if y'all want to go look at it. I freaking love making getting ready drinks. It's like my own little version of my spicy margarita. It's so good. It's a little spicy. It's actually very spicy. I'll, I'll give it that. I'm about to start doing my makeup. I'm going to film a TikTok for that. I do so many get ready with me's on TikTok for things like this. So if you're not following me on there, be sure to go check it out. Baby, you make me feel so la 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 lovely. I keep on running, no, I should have wanted a high. I keep on falling right into your down, I can't get you off my mind. So sweet, yeah, I need it from you. Got my hands all on you, sweet. Everything I wanted, sugar like yes, please. Love is like candy. I'll be honest, this is not my favorite outfit I've ever put on. Um, I bought this bodysuit today while at the mall shopping. You just gonna have to deal with the bruise on my lip, whatever. Um, because, anyways, I tried this on today at Aerie, the, this bodysuit, I was like, that's so cute. And then I put it on these jeans and I was like, I don't know if I'm vibing with it anymore, but I don't have time to change. This is the fit, I paired it with heels. I thought that would dress it up a little bit. Um, we're going to this, uh, it's like a traditional Mexican restaurant. It's called Tulum, super cute in there. Whatever, I think he's almost here. So, um, I'll let you guys know how it goes. Super excited, other than the fit situation, but it makes, I feel like these jeans make my butt look good. <laughs> Whatever. Hello, I am back. I actually got back at like 8.30. It's now like 9.45. Oh, I am so tired, it went well. Oh. I mean, I feel like I could take, well, obviously a nap, but like I'm about to go to bed. That doesn't even make sense. Is your butt clean? I'm just making sure. We had another little incident today because you keep getting caught in your fur. You wanna say hi to the people? Ugh, okay. I've literally been in this outfit for too long and it's like a bodysuit. And 
we all know how bodysuits feel. And so I need to take it off and get ready for bed. Tomorrow, I'm so excited for tomorrow. You wanna know why? Because the Band Camino's album, first of all, comes out at midnight tonight. But I'm not listening to it until one of my friends, Kai, comes over. We're having a listening party to the entire album together and I'm so excited. And so she's coming over and then me and some other friends and Kai as well, like we're meeting up people to go to Kitty Trail Ice House. We're just having a little fun Friday. Oh, so for dinner tonight, I got, um, what was it called? Chicken enchiladas. <laughs> got chicken enchiladas and I got a little skinny marg. And he got a, what was it? What do they call it? A Paloma? I don't know why I get Palomas and beach, be, words. Peach Bellinis. I get those mixed up. I'm not exactly, I, I don't know what I'm saying anymore. I don't know why I get those mixed up, but to me, they are the exact same thing. But one's with grapefruit, one's with a peach. Like peach Bellini. It's not a peach Paloma. And then um, he got like this fish catch of the day thing. It looked really good. But yeah, that was fun. That's all that I have to say. These jeans are just knotted. This whole outfit just did not succeed. Good morning, happy Friday. Yes, I'm in the exact same bodysuit as I wore last night. I just figured like I only wore it for like two hours, like it's fine. So we're, we're making it casual athleisure vibes because the material's kind of like, I don't know how to explain it, but we got this, airy. These are, I think they're altered states, but they're just like little flowy shorts. And then I'm also wearing my ooh, altered state sneakers. Um, I'm getting lunch with my family because um, my cousin Noah, he is actually flying back home. He's been over here during the summer. And so I gotta say bye to him. And so I was like, let's go get some lunch before he leaves. So we're going to Fuzzies. That's the fit. Let's go get some boom. Lunch was good, said bye to my cousin, and now, whoa. Um, now I'm gonna go get my oil changed. I've, I'm like 700 miles overdue. <laughs> so I need to go and get that done. And we all know how great of an experience I have whenever I get my oil changed. So hopefully this isn't too terribly bad, but that is what we're gonna go do right now. It'll be fine, yeah. How much is it normally? That's okay. That couldn't have gone smoother. That was the easiest, most smooth oil change I've ever experienced. Um, they're asking if I wanted to replace my air filter. And honestly, I probably could have, I could need a replacement, but they're charging $50. And he's like, I'll knock off $15. And I was like, no, that's okay. Looked one up on Amazon for $12. So, you know, I'm about to be doing that myself. DIY. Hello everyone, this is Kai. Hey. We just got some Starbucks and I'm Show. introducing her Show to me. the matcha drink. And She's a little green today. She's <laughs> very green. I'm kind of nervous because I feel like it's going to be like a ton of chai, or not chai, matcha. But cheers. cheers. Okay, it's actually it's not, not bad. Yeah. It's not as matcha as no, I thought no, it would no, be, no. thank God. But there are some get, chunks like, in my, yeah. Our plan today is to listen to the new, the band Camino album. <laughs> Did you tell them we got tickets? Oh no! Ah! We're going to their concert in <laughs> September. That's kind so of sad. I know. That's like almost an exact name. It's all. a week after my birthday, everybody. So, holla. Happy birthday to me. The album is here. It's out! I'm so excited! Okay, live and true raw reactions. <laughs> what am I missing you for? Don't mind us, um, my phone overheated. <laughs> so I'm happy. <laughs> but it's straight in the air right now. How, tell me how I'm supposed to breathe in no air. <laughs> Wait, that ending is so that was good. good. Oh! No! Oh, just oh my god, it wasn't even recording. No! Hello everyone, happy Sunday. Um, I didn't vlog really anything yesterday. Kai, um, Kai and I were really just hanging out. We are big couch potatoes. And we were like, this is our first weekend where we haven't had anything that's like go, go, go. So we really just took advantage and just sat on the couch. We watched some football. It was their uh, Cowboys first preseason game last night. And so we turned that on for a little 
literally just sat on the couch and did nothing. <laughs> it was great. No, it is about nine o'clock. I woke up on like the wrong side of the bed this morning and I'm just in like such a bad mood. I hate when that happens and so I'm trying to get myself out of it. I ordered myself a matcha from Starbucks. So we're waiting on that and I'm heading up to um, church to meet some of my friends up there and obviously go to church. I am just annoyed at nothing. Nothing is going on. I was trying to talk to one of my friends this morning and she wasn't being annoyed like at all. She was just speaking and I was like, I'm so annoyed with this person right now. I can't talk to you. <laughs> like, I I don't know. I really don't know. I hate that. I'm just in a mood. Um, hopefully this mantra helps a little bit. Hopefully a little bit of Jesus will, you know, lighten the spirit. That service was so so good if y'all are interested i'll leave a link to um like the live stream or whatever it's gonna be one of those that i'm gonna listen to again later on this week so oh, i started tearing up at the end i was like i gotta pull myself together i'm now at the car wash getting my car wash because it it was in desperate need apartment to bed officially <laughs> I really was kind of hanging out for a little bit obviously I got a lot of cleaning done oh I need to move my laundry crap I forgot about that I'm gonna move the laundry gonna get ready for bed and get in bed and go to sleep but that is the end of this week's week in my life I finally did like a full week not just five days but I also didn't really do like a ton this weekend I tried the effort was there <laughs> but that comes to the end of today's vlog and I will see y'all in my next video bye